Hey, what's up? Welcome back, Nurse Tina here. So in today's video, we're gonna go over how to transfer blood. You have an order to collect a blood specimen to check your patient's CBC and electrolytes. So you've collected the vials, you've done the phlebotomy, and now you need to transfer it over. So we'll be using for today's demonstration a vacutainer. So I have the blood here. I've already done my waste, so this is not diluted. I am going to start off with getting the vacutainer and attaching it to this end. This is the best way to be able to transfer over blood because you don't want to run the risk of getting stuck by a needle. And then I'm going to use my green top tube, which is order of draw. And then I'll be proceeding with the purple one. So I'm going to collect about three mils. If you're not sure, you can always look at the vial and it'll say how much is needed, three mils. Typically it'll stop based on pressure. So I am going to put this inside. There's about three mils. You notice it kind of stops at that point. Okay, now I'm going to, I'm doing this slowly. I'm gonna remove it and then I'm going to invert it eight times. I'm gonna put that to the side and then I'm gonna collect my purple top tube, which we need about six mils. I'm going to put that in and you're gonna see it's collecting and based on the pressure it stops and we have a good amount. So then I'm gonna remove it and I'm gonna invert it eight times. Then I'm gonna label this. I'm gonna discard this in the biohazard, label it, make sure it's the right patient, and then I'm gonna send it off to lab. If you learned something new, consider subscribing and give this video a big thumbs up, comment below, and I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.